Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how to create anchor links for your Shopify store on many sections from scratch using the native site builder provided by Shopify themselves. So without further ado, let's have right in. So to actually do this is quite simple. And the first thing that you guys need to do is you want to make sure that you're logged into your Shopify account as an administrator. So as you can see here, here's what the dashboard looks like. And the idea is we would need to get access to the site builder and to get there, you guys would want to click on uh, online store under sales channel. So it's this little option right here. And when we go to click on it, there will be a little drop down with a bunch of different options to choose from. Now, the one that we want to go to is uh, the, the themes page. And it's this one right here. So this is actually our landing page or website for our online store. And we would want to customize it. So when I click on customize, it should take you to this page right here, where we get to manually configure um, our Shopify store. <clears throat> so currently I have a dummy store set up. So the idea is we would need to add a button ins inside a container or a widget. So I'm going to do button, actually hold on. I believe it was uh, rich text. So if we were to do rich text here, Real quick, here we are. We can add a button to it, just like that. And let me actually drag this to the very top. Let's swap it out, just like that. So what this is for is um, we're going to give our customers uh, the option to skip through a couple of um, surveys or um, features on our page and get straight to buying the products that they want. So you guys would want to select button just like this. So it's this one right here, or if you want to, you could add a new block, add a heading, caption, or whatever, but I'll just do button. And we can uh, basically give it a label. So we can just skip to store would do. And here we would enter a hyperlink that would uh, connect them to a product page, our product page rather. So it's this one right here. You have um, six selections, collections, products, pages, blogs, blog posts, policies, and so on. So because we want to lead them to the store, we're going to create an anchor link to take them to our products page. So we're going to select that and we're going to click on all products. This is basically going to create a hyperlink. So they, so they can actually click on this and they'd be taken to um, that page. So that's pretty cool. Now as for the second button label, actually I can just delete this. Let's wait for it to load. And yeah, that's honestly all there is to it. So yeah, hopefully this video will help you guys out. All you have to do from here is hit save and you're done. So if it did, if it helped you guys out, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. And if you guys want to see more videos like these, we do have a YouTube channel where we do guides like these daily. So be sure to show your support that by subscribing to the channel so you don't miss out on any of our videos. So once again, thank you all for watching and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.